I was sitting in the pub one day with a friend of mine, and he mentions Facebook. What's that, I said. Well, he says, do you know what the internet is? I says, I don't, but go on, tell me anyway. So he says, Facebook is where you can share things with people. Share what kind of things, I said. He says, pictures and videos and that kind of thing. Videos of what? He says, he says, well, I took a picture of my dinner. And I shared it on Facebook with my friends. Why would you do that, I says. He couldn't answer me. Did people look at them, I says. He said, 450,000 people said they liked the pictures of his dinner. What else would you be doing on Facebook, I says? Watching cat videos. Cat videos, I says. At this stage now, I suspended all disbelief. Go on, I says. Tell me about the cat videos. Well, he says, there are hundreds of videos of cats jumping off things, bumping into things and running away from things. Tis fierce entertaining, he says, laughing away to himself. I don't know. So... Dinners and cats. What else, I says. Fake news, he says. <laughs> well, nothing new about that that was there long before the internet. Go on, what else? Being offended, he says. Offended about what, says I? Everything, he says. There was one fella and he was offended because another fella wasn't offended. What was the other fella offended by? I don't know, he says. But he was a fierce, funny-looking fella. He had earrings through his face, his skin was dyed blue, and his hair looked like he had some kind of electrical accident. These days, if you don't go around looking strange, people think there's something wrong with you. Are you still on Facebook? I asked him. No, he says. Why is that, I says? Because someone took a picture of me when I was in the shower at a particularly bad time, he says. I didn't inquire any further. Whatever kind of clones thought up Facebook, I don't know. But whatever kind of <laughs> idiots use it is beyond all comprehension. Please, for the sake of all that is sacred, ban the internet.